Okay, everyone, welcome back to Ten Pines Bluff. This is going to be episode number 21. Um, and I think today we're going to be working on the church. Um, I just want to say thank you to everybody for all the recent love and support. And um, if you like our content, don't forget to like and subscribe subscribe. I don't know why I can't say that combination, but I can't. So we're just going to keep going with it. Um, and so I was just kind of looking around trying to make sure I knew where everything was at for this. I didn't find absolutely everything I was looking for. Um, but we're going to go ahead and get started and maybe as we're looking for other things, we'll come across what we need. So I was just gonna leave this a stone floor, but the more I looked at it, the more I thought, you know, this is one of the nicest buildings they have here. You know, and they took the time to gather all the stones and there's no broken windows and they've got casings. So this should definitely have carpet. Um, not too thrilled about this part right here but maybe I can do something with that so that it doesn't look like, um, you know, so it looks like stone right there. I don't know if we can, make sure I'm selecting the right thing here. Okay. Uh, what does that look like? better. I could maybe go back just a teensy bit more, I think. And there, I like that better. Um, Alright, so now with that, that already warms up the space. trying to decide. I thought maybe like a fireplace in here somewhere would look good. I don't know how I feel about it there. That's not horrible. But we've got to have some way to heat this big old ginormous building, right? like it could definitely go back some. Now if I could match that brick. We'll have to see about that. It'd be nice to, even if we faked it, if we made a chimney that goes all the way out the top. So let's see if we go in here. I don't know if any of... I uh, don't know if any of our brick here will match that, but let's... I don't think this will. This is gonna be... Oh, yeah. No, definitely not. And it's too wide. Um... And even if we did some half... Uh, that might not be too bad if we did a different color. Um. I mean, it's not going to match 100%, but... That might be okay. Maybe we do... Oh no, this is gonna have the white in it, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so we don't want to do that. Um... Sloppy red? What's sloppy red look like? Probably not the color we're looking for. No. 
Definitely not. <laughs> um, alright, so in that case, maybe... What stone is this? Doesn't really tell me. Maybe we go ahead and do this to match the rest of that brick. A minute. Let's go ahead and bring this over. Let's get in the middle here so we can kind of get it centered. And then let's bring it towards us. As far as whoop, strong button. Okay, I think I can get on board with that. And then if we grab that and pop you up here, are you gonna let me? There we go. What does that look like outside? That might be too tall. Let's go see. Uh, especially with that tree right there. <laughs> I don't I don't really mind that height, but we would definitely have to do something a little different with the tree. Um, don't want our tree to catch on fire. Okay. Uh, maybe we'll just I think we'll just leave it. Uh, now the question is, is are you going to let me snap you back to back? Probably not. No, you are. Good deal. And then we'll just go ahead and do this. All the way down. And one more. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now we've got a fireplace. Whoops. Or we've got a chimney, I should say. Fireplace and a chimney. Alright, that works. Now let's go ahead and grab our lectern. Um, and I think I want to go... No. Into... Snappy. church kit because they have a couple different colors um, so we're just gonna put these side by side so I can kind of figure out which one I want to do here Really tell just from that. So let's uh, let's do I'll have to space these out, but for right now I just want to see the difference between the two colors. in the darker color better. So that's the one we're gonna go with. Alright, 
So let's uh, figure out where we want our pews here. And how many rows. We are going to go right up to the wall with them. Oh, we are still sticking through the wall though. We don't want to do that. We want them to be out of the wall. Slow down. Alright, uh, I think that's plenty of space, so do we need to come up one more with the pew? I think so. straight. I'll have to try to line these up, but I'm not going to make you guys meticulously watch that, so we'll just kind of get them in here for now. Um, and then I'll work on the spacing and make sure... I mean, they actually might not be too bad, but... This one is for sure crooked. That also might just be perspective. Uh, this one's into the window seal a little bit and also crooked. There we go. Um, Alright, so I'll work on fixing all those, lining them up good. Uh, what else do we have? I think that was, that's it in here, right? We just have the, yeah, the lectern and the, was there like any like crosses or anything? Maybe not in, I mean, there's this stuff, but it's way too big. supposed to be on the outside anyway. know if we have a cross really anywhere. That's just the same thing, right? Yeah. Museum, HT. 
Federalist counters and miscellaneous. What are these? Oh. Okay. I love that. Hmm. Okay. Well, what we could what what we could do is make our own cross potentially. Uh, and then if I find something to replace it with, I could always do that. and see how does that feel might be too big unless we were gonna put a big old cross up here have the thick ones, does it? Only has these, so we might have to trade that out. I don't mind that. We'll think on it. We'll think on it. Yeah. I don't know, I guess let me know what you think on that one right there. Um, again, I'll try to find... Uh, some like some other like church cross type decorations I guess you'd call it um let's see I know there's a piano somewhere if I remember correctly it's in CBC Fall Under but I could be wrong Sources, decorations, containers, furniture. Let's try and furniture. Oh, I didn't realize all this stuff was in here. Uh, container. Got some neat stuff in here. that oh boiler okay yeah yes here's the piano um i think we'll put it like right over here in the corner make sure we're not into the wall we're not see how far back we can go uh, still pretty good there Maybe angle it this way just a teensy bit more. Now the question is, is there there's probably not a bench for that, is there? Um Is that the lean in one? It is. So 
Let's lean this up against here. Or maybe even just up here. We want to set another one down here like it fell. I kind of like the look of the, the one that fell better. There we go. Um, Alright, now I don't think there's a bench in here. At least not like a matching one that goes with the piano anyway. So let's um uh is that furniture? Yeah. Table, table, stool, chair. Oh, I think this might be perfect. Mismatch color and all. Now, just out of curiosity, if I sit down, yep, I'm the wrong way. I thought as much. Alright, let's flip that around, because if somebody does come in here and sit down, we want it to at least look like they're trying to play the piano. We do need to go in some more with it, though. There we go. That might prevent people from sitting on it, but I don't really care. Um, alright, now... Got some pretty plain Jane, and we need some lights also. Um, so for here... See if there's anything in here that we want to use. Power. Ceiling. This lady is mounted wall lights. Let's do ceiling. aren't so bad. Let's find a good color. Oh, there we go. I think we're going to do that one. find the, uh, here, you go there for a second, I gotta figure out where, oh, that's right, this does the weird, I mean, this might be okay if we did, I might have to use some lighting effects, but I really want those to be lower also. I don't know if we have some longer ones. No. Oh, we do. Okay, what about these? Are these too low? I mean, I'm gonna have to move. Oh. Oh, uh, here we go. 
So we might want to go between those and this one. So you're gonna make me like manually lower all of these? Oh, we do not have enough water all of a sudden. Oh, and now we do. If I have to manually do that for each one of them, it's not so bad. I just won't make you guys watch that. And I think we're just going to go with that color, just because I don't want to sit here and fight finding each color and... ...having to sit here and lower each of these. And these? Oh, I might not have power in here yet. So let's. I'm pretty sure the light's goofy from these, so if I have to use some lighting effects, but we're not really gonna know if we don't go get some electricity. And I think we'll do a large one for this. And let's go ahead and we'll put you back here. Yeah, they've got the weird, like, mist effect, which I don't understand, like, why they did that. Especially it's like you know, trying to use them indoors. So I might have to do like the ones without power. Um, and then just do my own light effects with them. Because I really do like these lights, but... Oh, hello, you are unassigned. Hey! Come here. You can... Why don't you come be a guard? Thank you. I don't think they can get up here, but now... Uh, let me get out of here... and... What's your name? Hi, Sally. Welcome to the settlement. I was pretty sure I hadn't found them all. And I have no idea. Dog me? Did you...? Oh, you're right there. Earlier, I kept seeing his name from weird places, and I thought he, like, wouldn't manage to get underground, but he must have been in just the right spot that he was hidden by something. Um, I mean, if we did the really long ones, we could maybe go along here. Well, I'm going to stick with those two for now, and then I'll, I'll kind of play with some different options and see what I like for that. Um, Alright, so now we want decorations. Um, I don't 
think any of these would be right for this. No. Um, yeah, I don't think so. Um, we got traditional. do one on each side. Let's try to... Yeah, line it up about there. I think that'll be okay. Even though we got the piano here, which I might have to move it for a minute to get that in line. Or, uh, and we're stuck on a pew. Let's go up with this just a little bit. So I might have to move the piano. The painting might collide with the piano, but yeah, it's going to. Okay, um, that's fine. Move it here for a minute. still mostly see it from here. That's fine. Okay, that brings us a little bit of color. Um, still kind of drab and dreary. Be nice if we could have some stained glass windows up here, but I don't think... I mean, I could do it, but I don't know how well they would look. And I wouldn't be able to do it over there, so no, I don't think we're going to do that. I don't want to take the time to get stained glass in each of these. But we could do the upper windows, maybe, of each. I'll have to think about that. Okay, well that would be a question for you guys. What do you think? Stained glass or no stained glass? I could switch every single one of these windows out to stained glass. Um, I would leave these window frames in, and what we would do, when we get, well, we'll just do this one. Um, let's get over here. Parts and God rings, building items, glass and windows, frame glass, frameless glass. Um, all right. So basically, what we would do is get those to not snap. <laughs> um, that one would be all right. Um, it's just a matter of color here. I don't really want to design. Oh yeah, maybe something like that. And then I would have to raise it up and maybe pop it in. Um, what else do we got? And then whatever we did, we would match the lights, too, also. So you can actually, like how it says, frameless glass 2-11. Um, so you would just find the corresponding light to go with it. go outside. Yes. We need to 
go up. Stop the lag. So yeah, we could go all of them, and we could choose even potentially a different, you know, style of a you know, different color or whatever. Um, and I, I would say if we're gonna do it, it's gonna be all or nothing. I could take the time to do just like the top half of the windows. But I just don't know, I mean, really, I don't know that anybody needs to see outside. Um, yeah, tell me what you think. Let's go ahead and, it looks like it's getting dark, so, let's see. Uh, let me turn my pit boy light off also. Yeah, see, those just put off such weird light. I do like that, though. Um, oh, let me get around the electron. Let's look at it from outside real quick. Not sure I'm sold on that color. Oh, if I'm being completely honest. I think I do want to change this to stained glass. I don't know that I like that combination of stained glass. Um, so I'll continue to look through those. But you guys let me know if you want off can or uh, stained glass, no stained glass. Um, and then I will try to put up some different lights between now and the next episode and do some lighting effects and we'll see what happens with those. I do love like the pretty colors this gives off, but it's just, I don't know what this like smoke and mirrors stuff is. This was completely unnecessary for this mod. Um, all right, so let's turn that back on. I think over here, we've got a little bit of time left. Maybe we put like a coffee type station over here. Coffee and cookies. Um, donuts, whatever. Uh, so let's, let's go get like a table of some sort. Nah, uh, well, it's not going to be in there. Let's try furniture. Tables, business home, office. Um... Let's see what we got for business. Yeah, I was thinking something like this. Put out just a little bit. Alright. Yeah. And let's come out this way just a teensy bit as well, because it looks like we are in the wall. right there. And we can maybe go this way a little bit. About right there. Alright, yeah, so let's put some... Let's put uh, maybe a burner plate and a coffee pot thingy. I don't want to overuse the uh, Slocum Joe's coffee pot. Um having trouble remembering where that would be. Decorations. Um, let's 
see, do we have... I mean, we could maybe do... That's too big for here. What about one of these? This might not be bad, though. Yeah, let's do one of these. Again, I know it's covering up part of that painting, but that's fine. Um, we would maybe want this out just a little bit, though. Not yay. Um, alright, what else do we got here? That's it for that. Um, better have some coffee. of them with one stacked on top. Yeah, I think like that's fine. Um, what's this? We are still going to do a hot plate though. Um, let's see. It's got to be the front of it, I think. Yeah. do a hot plate here and we'll put a kettle on it so um, maybe this will be a nicer one it's brand new we just got it uh, let's see we do have some curtains here I don't think I want any of these oh you know that's something that we haven't um we should give our poor doggy here a doghouse. And I keep thinking about it every time I come to the settlement and not doing it. Um, where are we? We're going to put you. We're going to say you. Since you hang out over here all the time, let's put the doghouse right here. Layla, I think is her name. Maybe that's a dog from a different settlement. And of course, now she's nowhere to be found. But that's where we're going to put her. And now that that's there, I'll remember to put out the food and water dish next time. Or, you know, when I'm actually decorating. Yeah, there's a border collie here at the settlement. She hasn't had a home. Alright, so that gives us that. Now. We're gonna need some coffee cups and let's see. Household. Yeah, okay, yeah, there's nothing else out of here we wanted. Um, electronics. We could put a little radio here. Maybe turn to uh, Diamond City Radio, perhaps. Um, you know, then if they're in here, like cleaning or setting up or whatever, they can listen to the radio. You're kind of in my way. Excuse me. That is floating, so let me drop it down. Oh, wrong thing. And that didn't pop back up. There we go. Now yeah, it's sitting on top of there. Alright, um... Okay. Oh yeah, we needed some cups and stuff, huh? So let's go to... OC Decorator, maybe?
coffee cups, I thought. But maybe it's gonna be in dinnerware instead. I bet it's gonna be in dinnerware. And we're gonna do clean coffee cups. Not everything in the wasteland has to be dirty. So neatly stacked stack of cups <laughs> and I may have to fix those later we'll see but for right now we're gonna leave them there and then you know at least they're there um, and I guess maybe we should have some you know, just regular drinking glasses if somebody wants some water and maybe we'll put a pitcher on the table for some water probably rearrange all of these better but for right now I just want to get them out so that we have them shot glass uh, and I might re I, I'm probably gonna end up rearranging this a little bit I'm not 100% happy with how it's turning out um, we're also gonna want maybe like a tray of donuts but I'm gonna wait to put that on until I'm done rearranging so that I know where I need to put it. Um, all right, let's uh, get out of here. What time is it? If we wait. Oh yeah. That would make it 517, let's go 617. Sun should be coming up. We've already got somebody in here. Nicole is having a tough day. Came in here to pray. Um, I don't know. That's kind of a, you know, I don't know how people would feel about church and God and all of that after the apocalypse. And I'm not, you know, one to, you know, start a conversation like that on my channel by any means. I like to keep politics, religion, anything volatile, you know, out of chat and out of my gameplay and discussions. But as this does relate to Fallout 4, that is an interesting question. I mean, obviously you have the children of Adam, and then, you know, people following the Institute, people following the Brotherhood of Steel, people following the Minutemen, the Raiders, like all of that, you know, kind of all their own little factions with their own beliefs and ideas. So it's kind of interesting to think about where would the traditional whatever religion you are what would what would that look like in the post-apocalyptic world would anybody have kept that alive hmm. so anyways guys let me know in the comments if we should do the stained glass um or not and i don't know if the sun's shining in there yet let's go up and see not really we, we almost should have done it on this one It's okay though. So stained glass, no stained glass. Oh 
looks so pretty with that tree, with the sun coming up, and the light shining on it. Wow. Beautiful. Okay, guys. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Um, let me know what you think about the stained glass, and I'll probably do that off camera unless anybody wants to see me, you know, get all of those in place like I did with the, the one that we used as an example. Um, if not, then I may start working on, I think, the school next. So, thank you for all the recent love and support, and if you like our content, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Bye!